So, with a new sister, or should I say the true version of sister finally arriving, who seemingly has a little bit more of a cocky attitude than we kind of was expecting. Like, we was expecting this special little snowflake, little innocent nun lady, and it was like, no, she seems like she's got a little bit of an attitude on her, so I've been like, okay, let's see what we've actually got with this girl, and the fact of the matter is that as well, that, that Shiggy's actually learning some stuff with about his abilities and his powers, so we're actually getting to see what he can fully do now, already a half, like, half a year into the series, so I'm happy to know that, like, Shiki has other stuff into his arsenal, which, immediately, like, the start of this chapter, which chapter 25 is, he is already fully utilizing a good chunk of it, uh, that we've had up to the arsenal. So, which, again, we get to see him using it against, like, uh, like, all the people that he's going against right now, like, on there, where we see that the fact that he's able to compress the gravity balls he has in his entire ether gear, where he's like, I just need to work this out, like, what, like, Rebecca was, like, kind of teaching me, where he compresses them, and kind of fires up, like, a sh uh, like a scatter shot, like, he just fires them around, and it was, like, hitting, like, all across the arena, and he's just like, what, what's up, and all that, you think you got, like, uh, any chance, and all that, like, it's like, I just need to fire, and I need to do that, and you see with, like, what exactly happens when he fires, like, these compressed little, like, uh, abilities going around everywhere, where it's like, it hits that one piece of shit just right in the chest, and he just blast back and he's just like oh this feels like a this feels like a cannonball he hitting me right now as it like blast him into like a good part of the arena interesting enough that like when Jin like comes into this scenario with like sister and it was like oh sister just straight up grabs Jin and just uses like him as a shield with like her weird like robotic uh, like arm thing that she has and she's like well it doesn't matter anywhere and all that so whereas like I'm able to just like heal you because like this is sister's ability which she's able to use where it's just like i have the knowledge to like heal you so don't worry about it as like you see like jin's body getting healed and same thing with the other like the fish looking dude is guy and he's like you know guess what though uh, like it doesn't matter and all that like you can just keep taking hits for me because i'm just gonna keep healing you back up whereas like she like uh, immediately shiki was getting pissed with this like kind of whole scenario on there where it's like i'm gonna like take all you good little guys down is like managed to even get like a point where it's like a good thing that like he was getting taught like whereas like rebecca was actually even trying to teach shiki throughout like the power like using video games as an example on there like uh and using like her own way to shoot and all that and it's just like uh, the fact that like shiki's like what the hell is aiming what do you mean what the hell is aiming like on there it's like look you just need to like actually like envision your target and go like concentrate on there it's like look you're gonna need to like you need to anticipate and align your aim when it comes to these things so you gotta predict it's just the movement a little bit you're like it's basically you can't just fire and go uh, just hope it works you kind of need to use visual indicators saying like it's so like is the guy now moving towards his left then you need to adjust it a little bit for there like you work it that way like just think of like overall way of, like how you move to it like you get little indications and all that where it's like, look, they're all going to come from here, like, and you know that the enemy loop moves like this. So align it, and you just work around this and all that with, like, your dynamic visual, like, kind of, like, recognition, and you'll be able to do this. Like, so, I mean, pretty much, um, I have no idea what Shiki and, like, Rebecca are playing. Like, I think they're playing Time Crisis or something, like, on there. And, like, we all know, like, the best gun, gun game out there is, like, you know, House of the Dead. I'm just saying, like, but I appreciate a bit of Time Crisis as well. Like, House of the Dead 2 is just, mwah, it's just fantastic. But it's like, what a good way to learn. It's like... How did you learn how to shoot? I spent hundreds of hours on House of the Dead. Or Typing of the Dead, if you people know, back on the old Dreamcast, the yeah, that back in the day. But it was like a weird little thing where it's just like, this is how I learned how to shoot. Uh, like That's like me saying, I got good at karate by playing Tekken 3. <laughs> like, I got really good at wrestling moves because I was playing King. That's what I want to see for this shit. <laughs> like, I, I, there was something just amusing I found of that. But when we got to see that, like, Rebecca coming back to, like, her side of the story where she was uh, trying to find the little girl, I believe her name was, like, Co uh, Copa or Copper, like, uh, where she's like, where are you and all that? Like, I need to find you right now. And it was like, that piece of shit, like, ugly frog motherfucker where he, like, got a gun to her head right now. And it's like, we just realized that we need to get out of here and there's a bunch of people that are turned into statues right now and it's like i need to see if i can go and get them and it's like oh and then the little girl's like oh please help me little um uh like a big sis and all that please and it's just like 
Wow, I am pissed off. I've had my complete teeth knocked out and all that. If you don't want to get, uh, if you don't want to die right now and you don't want to see this little girl get her brains blasted out, you are getting on your knees right now and kneel for me, you scum. And Rebecca, not having anything else that she can do right now, like and all that, feel like, like I'm not at an advantage right now. Is that she is just getting her head stomped in from this like frog guy, and it's just like you're gonna be my toy forever. I like he's. To uh, toying with the gun and all that, saying, you can't do anything and all that, because I'm going to shoot this little girl if you try this. And then, right as the right time where that little guy, uh, one of his servants come in, and he's like, Elga, we're in trouble, we need to get out of here, like, the chronophage is coming, and it's like, no, I was like, uh, I don't know what that is, but he's like, look, we need to live right now, it's going to take away the planet's time, and we're just going to die, so we need to live, oh, and he's like, but I don't want to leave my precious collection, he's like, dude, we can just get another one right now, don't worry about it, and it's like, this has already betrayed us, and like it's best for us to leave the, like this whole planet. Just get along. He's like, well, I guess I'm gonna get the girl. And then with a dynamic slide shot, Call of Duty style, like on there, bringing in your, uh, your uh, Black Ops on there, Rebecca comes in with a side swipe and just blasts the dude in the brain. So getting to see her using another gun compared to like what, we, like again, we're only just used to her using something like what we've seen with like sort of the happy sort of guns, but no. Full on using a proper just or rifle as he just takes that like brain out of, like on the uh, on that dude and also as well like of solitude and the chapter like ends with like what we had with sister where it's like huh I'm you're gonna be pin uh, you're gonna be uh, punished to the be the ki uh, demons king's toilet and I was like all right then so yeah she's the, such a little innocent little nun lady it's like no she's got a little bit of the sa savage side on her so it's like. I'm curious to see where the chat is going with this because she's definitely been a lot more interesting where we're going and especially with like the preview that they like showing out the chapters. I am quite excited to see what we're going to be seeing next to this and all that. So overall, and there you can see what you guys think um, about what you thought about chapter 25 like, yeah, like uh, coming into there. So that's all for me. Thanks so much for watching and I'll see you guys though next time.